everyone. My name is Julia. I'm the English officer for the Dynamic Youth Games Project. And right now, I'm at Sutherland Bay. Exactly where I am. It's known as the semi-fit dunes. The semi-fit dunes is very close to the ocean. It's just after the Pioneer and the Fall dunes, just before the June heat. This is a habitat that is largely dominated by marron grass. Marron grass is this wonderful plant that can grow at a faster rate than the sand being accumulated around it. This creates a fantastic positive feedback loop. But as the marron grass grows, it causes more sand to be built around it, which causes it to grow even smaller, which causes more sand to be built around it, and so on and so on. Eventually, this creates the formation of our semi-fit genes. Marograph is also fantastic at holding the sand particles together. It has these really, really, really deep root systems right to the bottom, holds that sand together, stabilises and helps form genes. It also creates a fantastic habitat for other plant species. One of them over here is our sheep-sits flower. The sheep-sit flower is this beautiful powdery blue flower. It grows in the semi-thick dunes and relies on the kind of open bare sandy land. It's also a great positive indicator species. It shows that our dunes are healthy. So the more sheep-sit we see, the healthier our dunes will be. Sheep-sit, so the flower also is a great nectar source for all of those insects that rely on these dunes to be able to during some months. Now this dune this habitat, it is under a threat. The biggest threat to this dune habitat is overvegetation and the encroaching dune heat onto it. The, the semi-thick dunes do see this really, really thick habitat here. It's a little bit from one end to the other. But the slowly over time it's starting to be squeezed out and now you only see a sliver of it as you walk along the coastline. Under the Dynamic Geoscapes project, we want to open up the habitat, recreate these bare sandy spaces and get these semi-fixed dunes back to their healthy and dynamic ways.